So the mash is on. Um, what I like to do is play about with the little red thing just to keep the recirculation flow nice and steady because I don't like it when the wart gets too high because then it goes down through the inlet pipe. I don't like it doing that, so that's why I do it that way. Um, today I'm brewing a clone recipe, one of my favourite beers right now um, commercially because it is cold, it is very windy out there. And it's just such a satisfying beer. It's a British strong ale, hits the spot. Fuller's 1845. Uh, and the recipe was found in a book called For the Love of Hops, and they presented it this way. 78% pale ale malt, I've gone with Maris Otter. 19% amber malt. Now, it needs to be Simpsons amber malt, because that's what Fuller's using. That's what I'm using. Um, 2% crystal, I've got um, a crystal malt from Simpsons which has an EBC of 130 and then 1% chocolate malt. Now, the reason why I gave it to you in percentages is because I actually think that's a way better way of writing down recipes because we all have different systems, different setups and we all do different batch sizes and it's a completely irrelevant if I told you I've used 5 kgs of Marit and 300 grams of crystal malt. It's completely irrelevant if you're trying to copy this. Uh, what I recommend is you go onto your favourite brewing software I use, Brewfather, um, pop in the percentages, play about with the original gravity, and you can get it all that way. Uh, the original gravity that you need to aim for is 1065, and the EBUs is 52. Um, you can use any type of gold in tops, I've actually gone with Brookhouse uh, Golden's Cobb 2018 Harvest. Quite excited to use them because they're nice and fresh. <laughs> um, and they're a British hop. But I guess all Golden's are really. Um, but the alpha acids are slightly higher than the standard EKG, 6.2%. So I've got 55 grams at 60 minutes and 55 grams at 15 minutes. Pop in a protoflock, yeast nutrient, done. <laughs> um, and the yeast, I wanted to use the Fuller's yeast, so I've got WLP002. And I've learnt from my lesson, guys. I've made a star. Um, and it does actually say on the packet that if the original gravity is above 1060, you should make a star anyway. So that's what I've done. That's what I'm doing. Um, and the water, Fuller's Brewery is like 10 miles away from here in Chiswick, so their water is probably very similar to mine, I don't know how they treat it, so there's no point using RO water, I don't think. So what I've done overnight, I've set this all up and I've put the AWS in, and I've put in half of a Campton tablet, and then while I was doing the mash, I've used some... 11.5 grams of DWB. So that should sort out my water additions. And it's beeping, so I better go. This is all you need Be your everything Yeah, I'll be your everything Still too soon to feel Please just say it real More than just a thrill Not just in it for the thrill I'm in it for the love Cause love it needs to touch it Your breath it on my body Babe, let me tell you something
let me know You know I will show Now it's up in the border With you through it all Winter through the fall You just make the call Yeah, I'm in it for it all I'm in it for the love Cause love it needs to touch it You're pressing on my body Babe, let me tell you something Is it supposed to smell like that? I know Dr. Han says always taste your yeast eyes. I forgot I poured it down the sink. I don't want to taste that because that is going in. Um, but the aroma is cider. Cider vinegar. WLP002, is it supposed to smell like this? <laughs> I fucking hate liquid yeast, I hate it. Oh, it just does not smell right. Oh, man. So, as for the brew day, everything went perfectly fine. Um, everything went perfect. Um... Mash efficiency, 75%. Original gravity, one, oh, 1065, which is bang on. Bang on the numbers. Everything is spot on. And I really, really want to put this in there. <laughs> they never fail me, never fail me. But this... Oh man, I might have to. I might have to flip a coin here. Am I gonna put in the liquid yeast that stinks of vinegar when I know something's not right? Where am I gonna go with the USO five? Uh, SO four. Fuck. <laughs> oh man. Actually, that vinegar smells disappearing. It might have been an initial something. Those of you that know are just screaming, I'll oh, just chuck it in. Okay, I'm going to do it.